No, no. It ain't Mr. Flair. It's God. And you don't need to be sorry. Just to remember my name, okay? Do you know I have a real problem with you right now? When I heard you were breaking this business, but I was excited. Because this is a business that needs young men. I repeat, men meaning man. Not a disrespectful little punk like you. But, Mr. Flair, just listen to what I... No, no, I don't need to listen to nothing. I saw what that went down between you and your dad. I was right there. You're not big enough. You're not man enough. You don't have the experience. You don't have the balls. You don't have anything that it takes to be where your father's already been. You got it? That's what's wrong this business now. We're breaking in punks. Punks every day. Guys that couldn't walk in my shoes 30 years ago, much less now. That's where you're at in my life. You got that? Yes, sir. Please just listen. No, you, no, no. I don't want to listen. You, it's not your turn to talk. You, tonight, are going to be out there live with your dad. And your dad has promised the world and me that he's going to kick your ass. Because you need that. And it needs to be in front of the world, the whole impact world. We need to teach you guys respect. I'm sick of walking around these locker rooms with whiny, crying little babies, just like you. This is a real sport for men. Men that have blood and sweat and paid the price to be around. And to make sure your dad doesn't go soft, don't be surprised if I'm out there tonight kicking your ass, too. That's how I feel about it. I'll slap you right now. No, no, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not screwing around there. I'll slap you right now. You better think tonight real hard. Because you got to deal with your dad, and you got to deal with Ric Flair. You got it? You got it? Sorry. I'll see you later on tonight. I would really think about what's going on in your life right now.